Epcor started in 1984 with one product, a Velcro closure elastic bandage. Hard to believe that uh, nothing like that existed in the marketplace, but that's the product that Avcor took to market in 1984 as an exclusive OEM relationship with, with, with the company that was then called American Hospital Supply, which of course has evolved into Allegiance and to Cardinal Health. From those very humble beginnings, the company built itself around other products such as S-Mark bandages and moved in 1999 into the uh, latex now non-latex uh, rubber tourniquet business. We now are the market leader selling 60 million units a year of non-latex uh, rubber tourniquets. The new products that we've developed have uh, ha speak to our compression therapy history with IceRite which is a cold compression therapy uh, device used for really anywhere you need to use ice. Another product called All-in-One that allows a nurse to uh, stabilize the IV site without having to build an arm board and stabilization system around an arm board with tape and gauze and other things that go with it. And more recently having moved into plastic surgery and maxillofacial surgery. One other thing I might add too is that in addition to manufacturing right here in Texas in the good old USFA, we source products from China, from India, and from the Dominican Republic. So we have expertise and bringing products in from other parts of the world that customers need and often are produced at a substantially lower cost. So AFCOR in the future is going to continue to be, uh, at least my goal for it is, to be a truly innovative company. Just as in 1984 it was an innovative idea to put Velcro closure and elastic bandage, today the all-in-ones, the MAC bandages and, and future products will, e will be equally as innovative and creative as we go forward.